Every day throughout the state of Florida, dairy farmers rise with the sun and begin the process of providing a fresh, safe, and nutritious supply of milk. It's a process that requires many hands and many hours, but for farmers, it's a labor of love. Dairy farmers take much pride in their work, knowing they are at the beginning of the food source. And the end result, a cold glass of milk served in your home, brings them plenty of satisfaction for a job well done. Family here at our farm has always taken extreme pride in the fact that uh, we're proud of the product that we produce first off. And uh, we, you know, it's been commonly called nature's most perfect food. With each generation, many Floridians become further removed from agriculture and understanding the true source of their food, such as milk. Yes, before milk arrives at the grocery store, it is produced at a dairy farm such as this one. I think it's important that everyone knows where their food comes from. It is produced by many hands, not just showing up at the grocery store. A lot of people have a big part in producing the food that we all eat. Floridians are fortunate to have a steady supply of fresh milk that is locally produced by farmers who work every day side by side with their animals and the land. The milking process here occurs 365 days out of the year. Every day, twice a day, cows here on the farm are milked. Now that farm helps provide a fresh supply of milk to the consumer. We know that uh, without farmers there's no food. Agriculture is Florida's second largest industry, with dairy playing a significant role. Florida's dairy industry is the largest in the southeast, with our farmers producing more than 250 million gallons of nutritious milk a year. A typical dairy farm is family owned and operated, and it's not uncommon to see moms and dads working alongside their children or even grandchildren to keep the milk flowing from their farms to our refrigerator. We take a lot of pride in farming together as a family. Each person brings his own talent and expertise to the farm, and because it is our home, we take a lot of pride in caring for this farm, and that includes the animals and the environment. We plan to be here for a long time. Dairy farmers are great stewards of the land. In fact, many families make their home at the farm so they have extra incentive to keep their land, air, and water as clean as they can. Environmental stewardship is an everyday priority for dairy farmers. There's a saying that farmers use a lot, that we didn't inherit the land from our fathers, we're just borrowing it from our children. And we have a real responsibility to, um, to preserve it and return it to our children in as good a shape as when we got it, or even better. Of course, it all starts with the cows and at dairy farms across Florida. The cows are the stars of the show. The average dairy cow weighs 1,500 pounds, and the most common breed in Florida is the black and white Holstein cow. Working with the, you know, the cows and the land itself, itself is, is just been an opportunity that I have felt very privileged to have. And hardly a day goes by where farmers don't get to experience the miracle of birth as the farm's next generation is welcomed into the world. The calves are given very special attention and care from the time they arrive. The calves are very special. They are babies. And as babies, just like a human baby, uh, they get their mother's first milk or colostrum. They grow up just like children do. They go to kindergarten, they go through a junior high stage, and when they graduate, they come back into the farm, into the barn to milk. But it's not just the calves that receive special attention. While no two dairies are exactly alike, one thing is for certain at all farms. Dairy farmers go to great extremes to make sure that all cows are well nourished, have clean and comfortable housing, and have access to a veterinarian's care should they need it. 
In order to battle Florida's warm climate, dairy farmers use methods such as fans and sprinklers to give their cows a cool breeze and a mist of water. When it's time for rest, many cows can do so in stalls that have beds made of sand. When you look at cow comfort and how we treat our cows, it is perhaps the most important thing that we do on the farm, look after our cows. Our cows have got to feel good, they've got to be willing to eat. It takes a cow eating in order to be able to produce milk, and that is the utmost important. A cow is not going to eat if she's too hot, if she's not comfortable. We put a lot of emphasis on keeping the cows cool, using the fence, using the sprinklers, keeping the beds clean, keeping them maintained, keeping the cow happy. That is the most important thing we can do here at the farm. And just like humans, a cow's diet is very important, and it often is designed by an animal nutritionist who understands exactly what foods are most beneficial to their bodies. Cows spend about six hours a day eating about 80 pounds of feed. Did you know that cows chew their food about 50 times a minute? A cow's diet is plant-based and consists of things such as hay, corn, and cottonseed. We also produce a lot of orange juice in Florida, and dairy cows eat byproducts of this process that otherwise would end up in a landfill. Cows also need lots of water to stay hydrated. Of course, these cows also put in some work, and that means heading off to the milking parlor twice a day, where farm employees carefully begin the process of getting the milk from the cows. Each cow is a member of a specific herd at a farm, and these herds are brought in to be milked at certain times of the day. It is important that the farm workers sanitize each and every udder before the milking process begins. This helps ensure the quality of milk to the consumer. Once the cow's udder has been cleansed, a milking machine is attached. This machine provides a sucking action that is similar to that of a baby calf nursing, and it allows the milk to gently be removed from the cow. Each cow will provide about eight gallons of milk a day. It's important that everybody know that the product we produce here, milk, is the safest in the world. And we test the milk here daily for antibiotics. No milk that any dairy farmer markets to the consumer has antibiotics in it. As soon as the milk leaves the cow, it is immediately chilled to 40 degrees or less and stored in a refrigerated stainless steel tank. It remains there until a tanker truck comes by the farm to get it. Milk is picked up from the farm on a daily basis, which assures consumers are getting a very fresh product. At the farm, each driver is trained to conduct a very extensive process to assure that the milk's quality is maintained. Once the testing is complete, the milk is pumped into the tanker truck where it remains chilled. The milk then begins a quick journey from the dairy farm to the processing plant. Once the milk arrives there, the care and quality continues. All milk is again tested in a laboratory to once more assure its quality. The milk then goes through a very important process called pasteurization. Pasteurization has been in use since the 1800s when it was first discovered by Louis Pasteur. This part of the process helps maintain the safety of our dairy foods, so consumers can enjoy a cold, delicious glass of milk with confidence. Each processing plant is, is highly regulated by the state of Florida. Inspectors are in this plant on a regular basis, checking to make sure that the plant is sanitized and all the equipment is cleaned and washed on a regular basis, and that everything in the plant meets the standards set forth by the Department of Agriculture. Innovative processors are exploring new packaging that will provide improved consumer benefits such as ease in pouring, as well as more efficiency for the retailers. The average supermarket contains about 30,000 items to choose from, many of them made possible because of the work done by dairy farmers such as those in Florida. So, the next time you're enjoying a cold glass of milk, a slice of delicious cheese, or some tasty yogurt. Be sure to thank a farmer for making it all possible. When I go to the grocery store, to the dairy case, I know that that milk 
is the safest, there is an abundant supply of it, it's the freshest that it can be. It's locally produced by dairy farmers just like us. That milk may have even come from our farm. That's real job satisfaction.